In this video, I'm going to be teaching you how to answer the basic likely questions on subject formula change. So, um, these are some of the questions you are going to be expecting in the basic exam. So, it's important you go through this video so you can get to understand how to change the subject formula. If you understand this concept, then I can bet you every question that is coming on subject formula, which is approximately five questions, you are going to be able to solve it. Now, the first one says make H the subject of the formula. Now, we've been given what V is equal to pi r squared H. Now, now you know you're looking for H, you have to do everything to eliminate other variables except H. So you say divide both sides by pi r squared. Now, when you do v over pi r squared is equal to pi r squared h over pi r squared. Now, notice what will happen. Pi r squared will cancel what? Pi r squared. What is remaining? We have h is equal to v over pi r squared. So, this is our final answer. And you can see the correct answer here is C. So as easy as that, you can learn how to change subject formula. Now let's go ahead and solve some other questions. Now this one says express X in terms of A, B, and C. If A over X plus B is equal to C. Now whenever you hear express X in terms of, another way to say it is make X the subject formula. So we are going to make X the subject formula. And from here, we have our equation to be A over X plus B is equal to C. Now, we will do everything to make sure A over X becomes isolated. We say collect like terms. So, we are going to say A over X will be equal to C minus B. So, that's the first step. Now, notice we can decide to put over 1 here. Okay? So, we cannot cross multiply, which will be A will be equal to x into c minus b. So at this point, we have our x as an entity and we also have um, c minus b as an entity. So we, to, in order to eliminate c minus b, we can say divide both sides by c minus b. So we're going to have a over c minus b is equal to x c minus b over c minus b. Now, if C minus B cancel out C minus B, we have only X left. So, we have X to be what? A over C minus B. Final answer. So, from here, we can see the correct answer here is B. Okay, so that will take us to the next question. Now, um, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like this video so that you can get um, to see other important videos we are going to be releasing that will assist you in your basic math exam. Now, the next one says make R the subject of the formula in pi R squared is equal to V R squared. Okay, so um, in order to solve this, let's write it down pi R squared is equal to V small R squared. So, to eliminate um, V, because we are trying to make R the subject of the formula, we say divide both sides by what by v so this is going to be pi r squared over v is equal to v r squared over v so v is going to cancel v so we have here r squared is equal to pi r squared over v so now we have r squared so how do we eliminate the square and have only R? We say square both sides. So once you take the square root of R squared is equal to square root of pi R squared over V. Now, anytime you do, if you have something like um, A squared and you do square root of A, you're still going to get back what? A. So at this point, we're going to have r is equal to, now square root of r squared is going to give us what? r, then we have root pi over v. So this is our final answer. Now if you check the options, you can see 
C is the correct answer. So we are going to take our C. Okay, so the final question for the day. Now this one says make x the subject of the formula in the equation 2a plus 2x is equal to b. I have 2a plus 2x is equal to b. Since we're making x of the subject of the formula, we're going to collect like terms isolating 2x. So this is going to be 2x is going to be equal to b plus 2a coming over will become what? Minus 2a. Now we divide both sides by 2. So this is going to be um this is going to be 2x over 2 is equal to b minus 2a over 2. So at this point 2 is going to cancel out 2 and we have our x to be b minus 2a over 2. So the correct answer here it's um d. So circle our d. Now Change of subject formula can be easy as A, B, C, D if you understand this concept. Now, um, if you have any question, you can drop it for us on the comment section. And if you want us to treat any topic for you, you can also drop it at the comment section. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to click the notification bell. And please stay tuned for more basic topical videos.